Once upon a time, in a lush and colorful jungle, there lived a friendly blue T-Rex named Danny. He was not like the other dinosaurs in the jungle, he was playful, curious, and loved making new friends. One day, as the sun rose over the horizon, Danny decided to pay a visit to his dear friend Allie, the native girl who lived in a cozy village nearby. Danny marched through the jungle, his long tail swaying behind him, and his big blue eyes sparkling with excitement. He reached Allie's village, where the huts were made of leaves and the air was filled with laughter. Allie greeted him with a warm smile. Her long black hair flowing in the breeze. Allie, Allie. It's me, Danny, he roared cheerfully. Allie clapped her hands with joy. Danny. I'm so happy you came to visit. Today is a special day at my school, and I'd love for you to meet my friends and teachers. Danny's heart leaped with excitement. He had never been to school before, and he couldn't wait to see what it was like. Allie led Danny to her school, which was nestled amidst the trees, adorned with colorful flowers and vines. As they entered the school, Danny was amazed by what he saw. The classroom was a large clearing with smooth stones forming a circle, and a big tree provided shade from the sun. Allie's friends were a mix of different creatures, from tiny birds to playful monkeys, all eager to learn. Allie. This place is wonderful. Danny exclaimed. I'm glad you like it, Danny. Allie replied with a grin. Let me introduce you to our teacher, wise old Mr. Owl. Mr. Owl, with his large, round glasses and a stern yet kind expression, welcomed Danny warmly. Greetings, young Danny. It's lovely to have you here. Allie speaks highly of you. Thank you, Mr. Owl, Danny said, trying to keep his excitement in check. The day was filled with exciting activities. Danny joined the lessons, learning about the stars, plants, and various creatures of the jungle. He showed off his unique abilities, such as how he could reach the tallest fruits with his long neck and how he could roar so loudly that it echoed through the jungle. During the lunch break, the friends all gathered under the big tree to share delicious fruits and stories. Danny told them about his adventures and the amazing sights he had seen in far-off places. The other children were in awe of Danny's tales, and they were impressed by how friendly and gentle he was. As the day came to an end, Allie and her friends were sad to see Danny leave. But they knew he had to return to his jungle home. Danny, we had so much fun with you today. Will you come back to visit us again? Allie asked, holding back a tear. Of course. I promise to come back soon, Danny replied with a smile. And I'll bring some of my jungle friends too. With promises of future adventures. Danny bid farewell to Allie and her friends. As he walked back to his home in the jungle, he couldn't help but feel grateful for the wonderful day he had spent at the school. From that day on, Danny and Allie's friendship grew even stronger. Every now and then, Danny would visit the school, and together with Allie and her friends, they would explore the wonders of the jungle and the fascinating world of learning. And so, the blue T-Rex and the native girl continued to share their friendship, bringing joy and knowledge to their little corner of the world, where dinosaurs and humans lived in harmony, celebrating the beauty of diversity and the joy of togetherness. The end.